This guy needs a duffel bag, Dad. Once we get these light ticklers hooked up, the stage show is going to be incredible. Doesn't anyone here just want to sit and jump? I don't like the look of that thing. Ah, peace and quiet again. How nice. Television, I said this, but eyeballs are kind of gross. If you look at them closely, I already feel horrible for saying that.
we are all just frequencies of the same beam of light, rainbow bound and bonded. Oh, think that statue's big enough? Ah, oh, well, you need a big ego at the front of the band, am I right? <laughs> My eyes feel so small, I think they might throw up. Is that possible? Is that what crying is? It's better, but to handle a crowd that size, we need the whole band, man. We need Tasty, Sniffles, Dr. Touch. And Audie. Yeah, Audio. You're remembering, man. <laughs> Where are they all now? Oh, they wandered off when the audience left. Could be anywhere. This festival covers so many acres. Hey! <gasps> Didn't we used to have a cool band van? Mobile. I'll bet they're still at the festival somewhere. Woohoo! So what's driving? They might have wandered into the campgrounds, it's true. Oh, let's try the concession stands. Are they Good idea. Let's look here. Well, this is the campground. Dr. Touch and Artie used to like to come here. They like to get high out here. So, you're saying they're up there? Yep. The 
The view up there is amazing. festivals like this. This one is surprisingly great. Oh. Still, where are all the bathrooms? Yep. Actually, I hope I don't find them. That would really be some emotional baggage here. Always do. No, we don't. See? Here you go. Me? You started this. Oh, choo choo. Here comes the blank. Didn't you guys see the huge crowd down there? People are screaming for the feast of the senses. That's what I've been telling this one. But the problem with him is that he just won't listen. Without psyching, there is no feast. There's nothing. But psyching is back. What? He's down by the van with Vision. But we're not ready. We haven't practiced. Dr. Touch, where are our instruments? I, I thought you had them. We need those instruments. The crowd's getting angry. Hey, that kind of pressure is not helping. Yes, that makes us just want to stay up here. Where it's safe. Maybe you could perform without your instruments? What could we possibly perform without our instruments? Hmm. Magic? I do know a little sleight of hand, you know. Please. Let me take a look. I bet I can find one. Sounds good to me. Let me give you a hand. Coming up. Hey, I love what they've done with the place. 
Okay, let's get those instruments and get out of here. If I know Audi, this is gonna sound awesome. Oh, and Dr. Touch is good too. Nick, I've got something. instruments get out of here. If 
I know, Audie, this is gonna sound awesome. Oh, and Dr. Touch is good, too. Careful. Dr. Touch can be a little handsy. Oh, Audie and I used to sneak up here and talk about our hopes and dreams. So beautiful. you cats again. Just so, so great. You look good, Psy King. Let's face facts, guys. It's not going to work unless we get the whole band back together. Well, we need sniffles and tasty. the situation. Nick's body is sending you... <laughs> Let's go somewhere else. Everybody, back in the van. Can't beat that old van smell. These are the concession stands. If they got hungry, they'll be here. You better drive? I don't want to brag, but uh, I've got uh, eyes. Hello, oh, let's try the concession stands. They might be there, and uh, I'm getting hungry. Ooh, our promoter's not... Good idea. Let's look here. Tasty and Sniffles hung around here a lot. Oh, so many scents and flavors. And lines, man. So many long lines. I'll go find Tasty and Sniffles. Sound. 
fearsome. into that hungry crowd, they would eat me. Me? Hang on, kid. We're trying to decide what to order. You can eat after the show. Vision and Psy King are waiting by the van. What? Psy King is back? Let's get our instruments. We've been in this line for so long, I'm not even sure where they are. If you guys let me take a look, I'll bet I can find them. Oh, Tasty, I can't decide. Well... Maybe I can find their instruments before they make up their minds. I have to admit, I'm a little afraid of this one. Why, because of all the tongues and boogers? <laughs> That's all just part of being in a band, man. Why do all these creeps hate you so much? This 
smells like the way across. Can you taste the sky? This is more tongue than I would prefer. So many people eat without really tasting. It's one of those double decker buses. Certainly an adequate supply of tongue is in here. I can smell my own sweat. You're not supposed to be able to do that, are you? Oh, God. Now I can taste it. God. Response is 
triggering. I say fight. Fight! Get out of here! I feel like I'm about to go on stage! You're handling this so much better than I would be. My heart is racing. I have a heart. Oh, phew. Oh, yeah. Back to my regular smell again. Which, if I'm being honest, I've never heard any complaints about. Oh, I gotta say, Sacking, you're almost looking like your old self again. I'm sorry I abandoned the band, you guys. Hey, it's gonna make for a better rockumentary someday. Time for the feast. Feast!
molecule through my cosmic eye. Senses are the magic keys. They fill the holes I've had. Unlocking all my memories. I never, never yeah. wanna bet, Elmo. Uh-oh. Oh, oh no, no, not, not again. again. I know her. From Lobato's nightmare. I know her from my nightmares. <laughs> Don't worry. All your friends are here. Friends? Oh, do you mean these friends? The ones who abandoned him in the ice for 20 years. Don't listen to her. Dear universe, please. Shut up! There we go. That's better. Problem solved. Ball of light? You're a helmet full bear! Everyone thinks you died in the deluge of Grulovia. What happened? <sighs> I can't remember much of anything. Well, if you don't mind, I can try to help with that. This was my stupid plan to defeat Maligula. You okay? Are you trying to slow them down or destroy them? You were going to act her to death? I did a monologue about Lucy's life and what she meant to us. To try and bring her back. I was useless that day. You were useless that day? I tried to stop her with a motivational speech. Actually, Full Bear, you distracted her long enough that I was able to recruit some local animals to help. Which also didn't work. We all brought what we had to the battle. The main thing was, your beautiful performance did bring out the old Lucy. Just for a bit. It reminded us that she was in there. So, Maligula used to be... your friend? And her name was... Lucy? <sighs> was she the seventh member of the Psychic Six? I'm learning a lot. Yeah, me too. I'm right here! Where are you going? Why did you all abandon me for a thousand years? Twenty. Maybe in your world? Did they even look for me? Did they all forget I existed? We did look for you, fool bear. But my stupid hyper high glaciator there, which we brought to freeze Maligula, well, it's a... Uh... It worked as designed, Otto. But you were so deep in that frozen lake, we couldn't find you. No matter how much we duck. I know you're just speculating here, Helmet. I think you're probably right. But I sent you my brain, Ford. 
Didn't you find it? I... I don't know. Ford must have brought your brain back because I found it in Otto's lab. But he must have lost that memory when his mind was shattered in the battle. My brain was shattered? Well, come on. It was a little crack to begin with. My body's been in hyperice all this time. I'll bet I look him. Oh no, I can't look. This is where that monster drowned my Bobby. Because I failed. Because my stupid plan couldn't save him. No, you saved me. You threw yourself into the path of danger, sacrificing yourself to save me. Rather dramatically, I might add. Well, I mean, thank you. So, I'm not dead. I'm out there somewhere waiting for you to come back to me. I'm coming to you, right now. I swear. Better hurry. You know how I get. Memories, my boy. Just a show we put on inside our heads. Sometimes the first draft of the script stinks. Thanks for helping me with the rewrites. Now let's go give the people what they want. <laughs> Everybody stand back. Remember, this is our friend, Lucy. She's going through a tough time. I think she might just need someone to listen to her. Save your sympathy for your shrubbery, Zanato. Time out, Lulu. your body yet for bear but not to worry i've got your brain and i'm going to keep it safe back at hq and come back for the rest of you just after i figure out what to do with lucy okay i know you won't forget about me i don't think anybody's gonna forget about you after that performance in fact i think they're demanding an encore Senior staff only. I'm... Who am I again? Nick John Smith. Nick John Smith, senior mailroom staff. Welcome. Helmet Fulbear, deceased. About time they sent me an assistant. Ford's gonna be so excited when he figures out who you really are, Agent Fulbear. Everybody is. Kid, I owed you one. And now we're square. But I'm not ready to face Cruller. Not until I talk to Bob. But... Lots of baggage to unpack. You wouldn't understand. But please, tell no one of my return. But... I'll see you at curtain call! Don't... Oh, somebody shut that door before the wind blows all my letters away! Excuse me, Agent Cruller? Clerk Cruller. Yes. 
How are you feeling? Busy. It's like nobody's been sorting the mail for days. Would you mind if I, uh, went inside your mind and sorted a few things out? Eh, I'm never opposed to anything getting properly sorted. We brought peace to Grulovia, but there is still unrest among the people. A little ungrateful, I think. Home soon, Lucretia. Ford's mind in here for me to reconnect. It'll probably be up in that giant clunky head. Hey, I came out of that clunky head. Really? Can you help me get in there? Uh, maybe, to tell you the truth. I'm not addressed very well, so I'm sure I'll be marked return to sender and sent back there soon. Just grab on. Did someone say return to sender? This letter's got no return address. I'm afraid that means the dead letter office for you. But wait, I'm a heartfelt love letter. Don't care who you courted, the feelings must get sorted. Stop a war? Ah, doesn't matter. I never sent it. Maybe it would have saved a thousand lives. Maybe just one. I wonder what would have happened if I'd sent that letter. I wonder if it's too late. out of here? Will you still take me up to the head? Yes, but quick, before he... Whoa! Ah! <clears throat> oh, my mistake. This doesn't belong in the dead letter office. <laughs> Look at that address. It belongs in the international dead letter office. What? No, wait! Uh-oh. Come <laughs> on. 
here's the hat box tag. Yourself. We're just worried about you. We love Ford and friends. Rain's not enough to secure my reign. Stop being coy with the boy Poloi. somewhere around here. Oh! <laughs> 
think I hear some emotional baggage nearby. The people have a no mix for me. They call me. Nah, oh, sound serious. I take it as a compliment. I like it so much. I can't remember being called by now. Just hold still. I'm gonna get you out of here. Oh, no. <laughs> Some ladders are such a pain in the neck, they really belong in the furnace. Wait. I think I know how to address this one. Really? Well, it's worth a shot. But don't take all day. The mail must sail into tomorrow, no time to borrow. Boy, I hope you know what you're doing. That's a key to the typewriter. Nugget is saying to me, take me away. Yep. She's gone bad. She's flooded the capital. We shall destroy this country. Get out while you can. Is that the missing typewriter key? I don't think I have all the keys I need to properly address this envelope. I need over there. Where is it? 
Send that off and see what we get. You see, a mail just doesn't matter. Private mailbox. You aren't allowed in here. You've been missorted. You touch that, and it's a federal crime. What did you say in that letter? Nothing important, really. Just that I loved her. She just wanted to help, but they, they pushed her too far. How should we have known? It's not like she was marked fragile. But I thought I knew her and everything she held inside herself. Ah, I had so much to learn. I guess some packages are better left unopened. of Ford's mind to reconnect. I'm making progress. But what if Maligula shows up here? And Ford's not ready. I need to hurry up. <laughs> 